Prophets are the mouthpiece of God. When they speak, God has spoken. During the Sunday service celebration on 27th of February 2022, Man of God Prophet Sanga gave a word of prophecy concerning South Africa. And these were his words. When I was praying, God is saying, Open your eyes. And I saw Na nikaona, a different nations. Mataifa mbali mbali. There was a names of that nations. Na kulikuwa na majina ya yale mataifa. Those names were coming closely. Yale majina yalikuwa yananijia kwa ukaribu zaidi. Very close to me. Karibu sana. I saw the nations of South Africa peering again my eyes. Nikaona tena taifa la South Africa likitokea mbele ya macho yangu. Even though this nation ingawa hili taifa it was like just coming and going coming and going ilikuwa kama linakuja na kuondoka linakuja na kuondoka but until god is settled this nation in my eyes mpaka mungu alipolituliza taifa hili mbele ya macho yangu i saw east leona mashariki east kuna jambo kutokea mashariki and south na kusini there's a plan of darkness ulikuwa ni mpango wa giza because i saw the very strong wind kwa sababu niliona upepo mzito mno very strong mzito sana destroying many house ukiharibu nyumba nyingi mno but i don't know why lakini sijui kwa nini i was seeing this wind from the east niliona upepo ambao ulikuwa unatokea mashariki at the same time south east the same time south it was like moving like this ulikuwa ni kama unaenda namna hii so if it's not from east kama si kutokea mashariki it from south ni kutokea kusini i saw it niliona hili and i saw a lot of house na nikaona nyumba nyingi mno being destroyed zikiharibiwa i saw the news nikaona habari something like nbc and i don't know nbc something the sabc okay yes i saw it niliona hili and as a blog na concerning the wind kusiana na huo upepo destroying many houses umeharibu nyumba nyingi mno in South Africa katika nchi ya Afrika Kusini and the others na wengine they died wakafa tree Meat was falling down ilikuwa ikianguka i saw it hilo nililiona i saw it nililiona i saw it nililiona but i wake to pray because there is the blood of people there kazi yetu ni kuomba kwa sababu kuna damu za watu mle and the people losing the house na watu wakipoteza nyumba zao I saw it. Niliona hilo. People losing the cars. Watu wakipoteza magari yao. And they were learning. Na wengine walikuwa wakikimbia. I saw it. Niliona hilo. From east or south. Kutokea mashariki au kutokea kusini. I saw it. Niliona hilo. I saw it. Niliona hilo. I saw it. Niliona hilo. So I wake to pray. Kwa hiyo kazi yetu ni kuomba. You know when God speak, unajua Mungu anapoongea. We don't need to wish that thing to happen. Hatupasi kutamani jambo hilo litokee. So is it good when you see people dying and losing their homes? Jeni kuona watu wanakufa na kupoteza nyumba zao? Is it good? Jeni vizuri? It is not good. Si vizuri. Yes. Ndio. On April 2022, South Africa lost more than 300 people from a flood that was stirred up by heavy rains and storm. And more than 250 people have died in devastating flooding in the South African city of Durban and the surrounding area. Formal settlements have been severely affected by the heavy rain and flooding. While the rain has slowed for now, it's expected to get worse. To catastrophic flooding that has killed more than 400 people in South Africa, tens of thousands left homeless. Search and rescue efforts are underway after catastrophic flooding killed more than 400 people in South Africa and left many more homeless. I saw east Leona something from east kuna jambo kutokea mashariki I was seeing this wind from the east niliona upepo ambao ulikuwa unatokea mashariki at the same time south east the same time south it was like moving like this ulikuwa ni kama unaenda namna hii and i saw a lot of house na nikaona nyumba nyingi mno being destroyed zikiharibiwa i saw the news nikaona habari something like nbc and i don't know nbc something the sabc okay yes i saw it nililiona hii and as a blog and the others na wengine they died wakafa tree 
Miti. was falling down. I saw it. I saw it. I saw it. I saw it. But I wake to pray because there is the blood of people there. Kazi yetu ni kuomba kwa sababu kuna damu za watu mle. And the people losing the house. Na watu wakipoteza nyumba zao. I saw it. Niliona hilo. People losing the cars. Watu wakipoteza magari yao. And they were learning. Na wengine walikuwa wakikimbia. I saw it. Niliona hilo. So I wake to pray. Kwa hiyo kazi yetu ni kuomba. Yes. Ndio. When God speaks, the wise listen. Keep watching POG Family TV. Jesus Christ loves you.